good morning. No, that's not right anymore. I'm going to have to get used to that. It actually not isn't warning at all. And one of the big, big things about this change to basic sorgonomics that we're doing here is one basic sorgonomic is I don't necessarily have to record this in the morning as it is now uh, definitely the afternoon for one thing, and uh, which is good. It's the hangover day for podcast day, um, and I did find myself with a little bit of illness. Somehow, my compatriot, uh, Eamon, who got sick in the middle of the PM show um, and made things a little interesting last night. i get better soon, buddy. Uh, somehow, he transmitted some of this uh, illness to me via the internet from San Antonio to me up here in Pittsburgh, and uh, I had a little bit of a rough morning, and, but we're getting going here. We got all the shows up. I'm trying to get into my task list, but just kind of running a little bit behind today of course but here i am um so uh today i thought we'd do a little bit of a snapchat up snapchat snapchat uh i did that last time didn't i uh snapchat update from one of the earlier good morning episodes from just a couple of weeks ago i'm having a lot of fun with it i wanted to talk a little bit about what i have been i've been getting responses for one thing which is like hey some of you guys are are, are looking at this stuff that's pretty cool and even right now i want to take a little bit of a snapchat for my friends that are following me on the story to remind them please check out basic sorgonomics um it's up today check it out sorgatron.com recording right now so give me a little bit of time to get that edited and posted uh and that goes out and that's it um uh, we were having a lot of fun with it uh friday actually and this is funny because i'm doing it in, in front of a lot of uh, uh college students and uh went to take a video and then put my phone away because i'm used to oh i take a video and I, I can go do this other thing and put the video up in a moment snapchat doesn't work that way and i'm still working on that mind mind frame and there's like like two or three of them they're like yeah you just lost that video i'm like you're completely right i just did and i'm supposed to be the video professional here um but no we had a lot of fun with it um i it, it's again with what I'm doing with it, um, and I'm posted the story, so everything is public, but I will post goofier things. Like I will post, you know, today that I, um, Hey, look, I'm, I'm, I'm sick and I look like shit. Uh, doesn't that suck? You know? Um, and I'm not going to put that on Twitter, right? I'm not going to put that in Instagram where it's going to stay there where it's more of that public facing side of things, you know? And I know the people, I mean, I look, I look at the list and I, I don't think there's anybody on this list uh, that's actually viewing of the uh, 10 to 14 people that end up seeing one of these. Um, you know, these are all people that are in my circle. We're not I'm not really expanding out to a public facing thing, but I'm, I'm entertaining the people in my circle and trying things out. Um, and I get feedback from that sometimes, you know, uh, and, and what we did Friday was we had kind of a video day at one of my clients, Alice Claire and export PA, and we were just trying to get a lot of videos in for this educational component that we're trying to develop and, uh, do some other stuff. And, and, uh, so we had a lot of videos set up. I kind of had my mini studio with, you know, the Google hangout webcam microphone set up for them to do the vid that video that way. It brought one of my, you know, prosumer cameras in and we had a setup there for anything that didn't require a slide show because we're using hangout in a fun way there i should probably talk about that again sometime soon a little frazzled anyways um and so i'm taking it like yeah hey let's check this out this is kind of my studio for the day hey this is this going on over here um and to the point where you know missy has been doing this fantastic fantastic new diet which is getting her back in the kitchen not to sound misogynist but she's really awesome when she's in the kitchen so it's a good thing in the long run right um and she really loves it and, and i'm glad to see her kind of reconnecting rekindling that her relationship with her kitchen in general but she's these great recipes through um this diet plan that i will talk with you guys at some other point um <clears throat> but uh I had fun with, you know, I, I wanted to take some videos of like her cooking and, you know, we don't like the, I, I don't think my kitchen's very attractive, you know, and I don't want to tweet it and stuff. I'm very self-conscious about, uh, how my house looks and, and putting that out there. Um, and, uh, but I put it on Snapchat. I have no problem putting it on Snapchat. Plus, I can frame things, and it goes away. It, it doesn't matter, you know. Um, and I, I got some feedback. I'm like, oh, I liked your snaps the other day. I'm like, well, you got to be a little more specific. I can't even go back. It's two days later, right? Um, and uh, But but we were able to kind of share that a little bit with people, you know, doing some fun things there. Um, the other cool thing is I get to audition things. So uh, I'm more free to pull out the camera and do the thing, snap it, and it's up there. And then, and then have that retrospective of, okay, was that any good? And you can download that and put it up on, on, on Instagram. There was a series of, of things that I did um, that, and I like this, that you can actually download everything in your story currently will download into one video. 
And yeah, it sucks to put anywhere else. I think I shared one of them on Facebook the other day. And I'm like, I'm sorry, it's a Snapchat. I really apologize. It's Snapchat because that's the thing I hate is those vertical videos. Um, but, you know, for throwing into Instagram or now Twitter video, Vine, I've been having a lot of fun kind of poking those together too. Um, you know, just yesterday, you know, I've been doing this WrestleMania thing and uh, was watching some stuff and taking some videos of uh, some guys coming out to the ring in WrestleMania 6. I'm like, hey, look, friend of the show, Jerry Sags, that we talked about in Wrestling Mayhem, or talked to on Wrestling Mayhem show such a long time ago. And did that and then and, and put it on the Instagram for Wrestling Mayhem show. So it's kind of given me this other on-ramp of creating content, like short content that's already ready-made for these other shorter formats that we're playing with right now. Um, and seeing what we can do with that, you know, and I haven't looked to see, you know, having the, Hey, here's, here's, here's the nasty boys. And here's, I, I forget what the other video I posted with Jimmy Anvil Neidhart just yelling, um, <laughs> in a promo, but, um, the promo was longer than the match. I want to point that out to WrestleMania six for heart foundation. I think the Bolsheviks anyways, um, but no, having a lot of fun with that and, uh, enjoying a, a, watching a lot of them too. Um, the, following a lot of friends, uh, following Mashable and the Real Verge have have been very entertaining as they've been going to Barcelona for Mobile World Congress, and they're like you can tell they're they're doing the rounds and they're having fun and they're trying to entertain themselves with it. And re meanwhile, represent representing the Verge dot com, uh, the Real Verge is their account if you want to follow them. Mashable Mashable also you know kind of interesting too, um, and. Uh, She's, uh, if you like S Felicia Day singing, she does that a lot on hers. <laughs> uh, Snap a ton day. I've been, um, uh, um, uh, recommending to everybody, uh, that will listen about Snapchat. Um, and, uh, yeah. Oh, that's what this was. I was trying to figure this out. Somebody told me about this and I went to look at it. I didn't understand it. Universal Orlando was universe. A, you know, universal O L or L. It just didn't parse in my head when I looked at it, but I am also not well right now and bobby cherry thanks for uh snapping me your cats every once in a while too that's fun too so uh uh you want to follow me i'm sorgatron on there uh kind of having fun with it. i don't know what to do with this you know for a, a brand or anything necessarily or managing that has got to be completely ridiculous like i think like guys at the verge all have snapchat but they all have the verge snapchat or they because i think it blogs you out of one phone to go to another so it's just not doing this multiple thing so you need so here's the tip for this is is if you have somebody's doing a snapchat you need like you're the snapchatter or you're the snapchatter of the day or something like that you know you you are charged with uh you know just doing stuff and this is one of the cool things I, I know one of the drawbacks of social media especially you know myself and friends that are trying to be a social media person and and uh, uh work for somebody that values it enough to say you are a person that does this and only this and that is your job versus you the secretary uh do a twitter account you know or, or whatever the case may be which happens in a lot of these companies this is kind of a thing where I think it's a lot easier for you to say, hey, you person, start Snapchatting, you know. I um, hope that they have a good perspective on the company, for one thing. But, uh, you know, it's 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 an easier pick up and play thing versus sitting at Twitter. And Twitter is, I think, may, could be a little bit of this if you're not so much strategizing, but just remembering to tweet, period, uh, from day to day about what's going on, you know. Um, but you know, but yeah, I get somebody, I guess, engaged to that point to begin with. And as we discover, some companies just have better things to do. They know they need to be there. They just don't know how yet. Anyways, enough of that. Um, if you want to see me more, then this is the other question I guess I can have on this. Do you want to see me rant a little bit more about social media on here? We, we do a lot of video production, but I guess I haven't done a lot of kind of, I want to say tips and tricks or what we've been doing with like Twitter and blogging and stuff. Maybe, maybe that'll be my thing for the week here. Maybe we'll kind of extend that out. This is me workshopping in front of all of you. Mike Sorg at Sorgatron. Question of the day. What's snappable? What's snapping? What's snapping? <laughs> this is not a Snapple commercial. Um, yeah, what, what's happening since the two weeks we talked about things? Have you been trying anything new? I've been seeing a couple of you guys on there that I didn't see on there before, for instance. Uh, what's new on Snapchat? Let me know. Comments to the YouTube here or hit me up at Sorgatron on Twitter. And also check out all the links and subscriptions for the YouTube and the iTunes 
on Sorgatron.com for this. I know it's going to be a little weird because half the places may have not refreshed yet for Good Morning. So look for Good Morning with Michael Sorg or Basic Sorgonomics with Mike Sorg. Michael Sorg. All over the place. We'll see you guys next time where hopefully I've come up with a catchphrase and stopped ripping off Panerai. This show is a member of the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. Find out more at sorgatronmedia.com.